I will also briefly talk about silver in resistors, but I won't be recovering either silver or gold in this video. And to be clear from the start, I am not purifying or fully refining any gold or silver in this video. I'm simply exposing it so beginners can see what's really inside. This is not hype. This is a real test with real results. A quick disclaimer here before we start. This video is for educational purposes only. Gold recovery and refining involves hazardous chemicals and should only be done with proper safety equipment, ventilation, and knowledge. Do not attempt this unless you know what you're doing. A lot of people believe resistors contain gold because some older resistors contain gold-plated end caps, and in some cases, silver-plated end caps. But not all resistors are the same. As a matter of fact, most modern resistors contain little to no precious metals at all. The goal here isn't to recover pure metals. It's to simply expose to the beginning viewer what precious metals may be in some of the resistors. All right, guys, check this out. It's showtime. Here is where the gold is. It's actually trace amounts, and it's probably not worth refining for most people. However, this is a really cool visual. The gold is located in the end caps, and in some cases, the silver. Now, when I process these, I won't do this on every resistor. I'll actually use certain chemicals to do it. But the visual here is spectacular. And now you see the gold. So for you beginners, this is the takeaway from this video. Resistors may contain trace gold or silver, but that does not mean they are a good source of precious metals. In most cases, they're not worth the time at all or the effort or the risk compared to better electronic scrap. So is there gold in these old resistors? Sometimes in very small traces. These resistors have gold end caps. This is a resistor with silver end caps. And these are the gold end caps that I've snapped off in the past few days. If this helped clear up the confusion, give the video a like. Subscribe for honest, beginner-level electronic scrap explanations. Let me know what components you want me to explain next.